Hello, hello, and welcome back to Law Mage Academy. Picking up after our continued bonding with Alyssa, and most recently we just passed the item crafting charms class. And uh, from here, well, I guess we grabbed our coffee as well. That was what we finished up with. Uh, but yeah, just picking up where we left off. It is not uh, far later for me. I just uh, made a fresh cup of coffee and, uh, I mean, tea, sorry. I was thinking coffee, went with tea. Uh, but yeah, just uh, continuing on, jumping back into it. Uh, I think that first up, we will probably go check out the uh, crafting and the recipes, see what's going on there with that uh, new teacher in, uh, was it West Wing 5? And other than that, we may do the other class today, we will see. Um, I don't know if it's going to be like a new event with her, because it, it did say again, like, after we hung out, go see if there's anything she needs, but I don't know if it was just saying that, or if it's actually going to be something. Uh, but there does appear to be a new notice there, so... I guess the chapel's open as well, so yeah, we, we actually have a couple things to check out. Uh, before we do anything else. How you doing? Alright, still uh, still on about those recipes. Alright, alright. As for anything else, I think we're good. We will check this. What have we got? Greetings. The item craft room is now open for candidates who have passed the class on item craft charms. You may craft weapons, potion charms in the item craft room located in West Wing 5. Magister Helga. Alright, very good, very good. Which is, that is exactly what we want to check out. Okay, so no new events for her right now. Fair enough. Grab the wood. So I'm going to assume just iron. Iron has events still, which I mean, I probably should do. Like it's probably worth it. It's just, you know, oh, this is way better. <laughs> no, I mean, I, I like iron, but you know, I'd prefer to hang out with Alyssa, you know, but there are probably in-game benefits to it. So I, I should probably, uh, you know, I don't know. Cause I, I figure it's more like, you know, completing the classes seems to be the logical way that the story is moving forward, at least for right now, like combat basics sort of move things a bit. Um, so I wasn't sure if it was going to be a class based thing or maybe certain dates or it could be a combination of things to be fair, but it seems most likely to at least go off classes for now, which may mean it's worth making sure I actually do, uh, iron stuff like because she hasn't got any more right now. So, you know, it's, yeah, it might be best clearing off iron however many days it takes before I do the next class sort of thing. Like, so I don't know exactly how things work, but just uh, can only make the best assumptions, sort of thing. Uh, hello. My friends, my friends assume I'm religious because I come from the Mollus region. The truth is, I come here often because it reminds me of my parents back home. Oh, that's nice. Fair enough. Fair enough. Once there is beauty, there is already ugliness. Interesting quote, isn't it? The Defined Scrolls is full of interesting proverbs like that. It goes to show that light and darkness are both part of the same whole. In the same way, productivity and leisure go hand in hand. Uh, same thing? Yes, indeed, indeed. Oop. We got... Wait, can we not? Oh, we can't get around there, apparently. It's gonna steal a jug of water. Greetings, candidate. I am pleased to see you here. Allow me to formally introduce myself. I am the priest of Law Mage Academy. My duty is to lead the faithful to the divine will. Okay, fair enough. I see that you have adjusted well to the rigors of the academy. That is good. Not everyone is as fortunate, fortunate as you are. That is why the divine church organizes donation drives to the less produced, to the less privileged people of Major Gaia. Well, it's always good. Currently, we are focusing our efforts on providing charms to help protect vulnerable villages in the northern Falherit region. Here is a list in case you wish to help us. Oh, okay. Favors from priest. Location chapel. The priest suggested that I make an offering of charms. Offer the following charms to the priestess. Beast necklace, tough earring, leather pendant. So, do we have the recipes to make them because we've, we're getting this quest? Like, how does that, how does that work? Okay. Good stuff. If you wish to contribute, you may come see me and offer your generosity to the divine. As the creed goes, to give and not to count the cost. Divine blessings upon you, candidate. Alright, alright. Well, we'll go into the crafting spot next, I believe, so we can check that out. And, yeah, I'm thinking it, well, let's just check this again. So, so, yeah, so we can't do, okay, so we have to do both these for that. Hmm. But still, it, it seems like it's probably still, yeah. I feel like from everything we've seen mechanically so far, it, it probably makes most sense to do the iron stuff. Um, because I, I don't know how they work either. Like she hasn't got any thingies now, but is that like a certain amount of days need to pass before she will have another event, or is something story related gonna have to pass 
Like, we'll have to get past certain classes before she'll have another one, or, you know, things like that. Um, what was I doing? Uh, we can just go craft, right? Yes, maybe. What was I... I thought of something. Hmm, not sure. Okay, it's fine. My, my mind wandered. Yeah, it'll come back if it was important. Alright, let's go see what we can... Wait, so where is the crafting at? Is it... No. Is the West Wing up here, or...? I mean, West Wing 5? Well, I guess West Wing, so they'd have to all be in here, right? Uh, oh, this is just one of the locked ones, was it? No, wait, what's this? Uh, was it a U, maybe? I mean, I didn't think it actually was, but... I don't know, I don't know, is this not... Oh, yeah, here it is, okay. What do you want, kid? <laughs> I want to buy things, maybe. Oh, clear water for 10. Nice, nice. Okay, so you sell some of this, the drops. Interesting. Basic weapons. Oh! You got some recipe packs. Interesting. Uh, I bet we need the, the charms pack to do them other ones. Can we view anything more on that, or...? Well, alright, let's buy it. Why not? Okay, so you can keep buying them. Alright, don't want to buy it twice. So did that add a bunch of ones, or...? Yes, yeah, so what do we need to make? Tough beast and feral. What? No, wait. It was, it was tough beast and leather. Was it? Was it tough? Wait, tough feral and leather. Was it? I don't remember now. Uh, was it? Oh, beast tough, <laughs> beast tough and leather. Okay. So what does that mean we need? Three leather and two fluff to be able to do that. We could already do one of them, no problem. With that two fluff, three leather. What does that cost us? Assume you sell those. Two, so we need three of them. Two of those. All right, that's, that's knocked our cash down a bit actually, but we may as well do the quest, so that's fine. Leather. Yes. And yes. Potions. Uh, I think we're all good. Alright, so there, uh, if there is no coffee thing here, right? Hmm, okay. And what do they do? 75 MP to all party members. 100 HP and 100 MP to one. 100 HP to all. Okay, interesting stuff. I think we're pretty much all good there for now. Um... Anything else we're going to want from you sooner than later? I guess the basic weapons pack. Not that we can afford it right now. Anything we could sell? Oops. Um. Well, we could sell this owl earring, maybe. Um. We sell the basic stuff. What does that give us? 75. Hmm. Let's sell... I have 22 oak wood. How much does one of them sell for? We could sell like two of them. I mean, yeah, I just want enough to get like, I, we're going to use all our money, but I want to get the weapon pack to see what we actually get. Why not? I don't know if we'll be able to craft anything, but so what do they give us? Is it just, uh, okay, so I must just give us this section then. Okay, so nothing we actually want to craft anyway, I guess. It's fine though. I feel like we want to sort of open them kind of things up, so that's fine. Um, yeah. Alright, I guess we can go uh, do that donation to the church. Why not? May as well. And then after that, I guess we will go probably talk to Iron. Yeah, I, I just, I don't know, it feels like the best option. Um, nothing else we could do. We don't have any books to read, I don't think. No. Greetings. How may I help you, candidate? Offer. Very well. Let us make an offering. May the divine accept this offering out of hands. An offering of charms to the less fortunate for the good of all creation and all that is. I need some tea. Thank you for co your contribution, candidate. Please accept this as a humble token of appreciation. May you find it useful in your endeavors. You received an N-Heal crystal. 
Is that just like a one of heal spell? It's not an amazing reward, but thank you. In case you wish to contribute further, we are planning to donate armors to the guards of the southern Felhurt region. Magical creatures have been attacking villages there as of late. They could use more armors to keep themselves safe. Well, I can't actually make those, so maybe later. I'll keep it in mind. I mean, because they weren't even selling a thing to make them, so... To give and not to count the cost. Divine blessings upon your candidate. I'll consider it. Not much, uh, not a great return on my effort, but that's fine. Uh, yeah, so, oh, actually, we should check these stores, shouldn't we? I wonder if anything new's in these. Anything, okay, same stuff there. Fair enough. Not the way we can buy anything either way, but nonetheless, we can have a look. Oh, that, that's what I was thinking before, but I, I didn't say because I wasn't certain. It was just a thought in the back of my head. Um, yeah, clear water here is 20, but it's only 10 for that other one. I wonder why it's double the price here. It's kind of significant. I mean, if you want to buy a bunch of them, I mean, yeah, you definitely want to go to the other one. So I don't know if that's just because, I don't know. I mean, we're a little bit further in the game, I guess, but I don't know. It just uh, seems odd that they'd be double. I mean, you're still talking lower prices, I guess, relatively speaking, 10 and 20, but it's still a big difference. Like, there's no way we'll be buying clear water from here. Hmm. All right, well, I think we're all good there. Nothing much we'll be selling for a little while, I don't think. How much do they sell back for? A uh, half, okay. All right. While you're traveling around, I just go make sure you pay a visit to me. Yeah, yeah. Other than the clear water, maybe. All right, well. I think we can probably hang out with Iron now. Um, yeah. I mean, I just hesitate because I don't like... The one thing, I, I, I don't want to like... Uh, I, if it was like a choice between bonding with him and the classes, like if I had to choose one or the other, I would choose the classes. But I still sort of assume they are going to be the thing that pushes the story forward, so... There was only 40 days, though. So... Hmm... Man, well, we'll do one. We'll do one with Iron. Hey, Sal, want to hang out today? Sure. Cool, it's good to take it easy every now and then. Why not? We can do a little bonding. May as well. We do only have two friends. <laughs> nice to see you again, Sal. What have you been up to lately? Class? Uh, spells? Well, I mean... Class, I guess, mostly. Most recently. That's cool, I guess. Class is going to be pretty fun. I'm actually getting the hang of potion craft. Can you believe that? No, good stuff, on Good stuff. So tell me, when you're not studying, what do you do? Ah, I've been hanging out with Alyssa a lot. Yeah? Is that why you're all, is that why you're hanging out with me now? Aw. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you chose to hang out with me today. I was getting bored. Well, you should be studying, buddy. Well, I should get going soon. Any plans after this? Ah. Uh, well, probably relax. Just for a little bit. Then do some studying. You're getting loose today, huh? That's great. You deserve it. Thank you. Thank you. Anyway, thanks for hanging out with me, Sal. It's always fun when you're around. No, well, good to hear that. See you again, alright? Yeah, see you, buddy. Now I need some tea. Alright. Just hanging out with a friend for an entire day again. <laughs> yes, make, making good use of our study time. Uh, what do we want to do tonight? Do we want to... Oh, interesting. So Alyssa doesn't actually have a... A bonding thing here. Alyssa seems nervous about something. Oh. Um, hi, Sal. I was just thinking about talking to you too, but I'm too tired right now. Are you available tomorrow morning? I'll clear my schedule for you just in case. Oh, okay. Interesting. Not really sure what to make of that. Save, yes. Hmm. I don't know if story's pushing forward or... <laughs> okay, um... Do I want to just sleep, maybe? I could probably do it. Well, I could earn some cash. Although, yeah. I think the bonding certainly more, more value to it. I could write Ian, Ein. Wait, is it Ian or Ein? I, I now don't know which one it is. <laughs> Ein, yes, maybe? Sure. You start thinking about what to write. Uh... Tell a joke, sure. Open with a joke. That's hilarious. Tell me more. Wait, what? 
You're writing in re real time. You spend the rest of the evening exchanging jokes. Iron seems like he's having a lot of fun. Wait, did, I did, what? The writing happens in real time? Like, how does that work? Is it like instant messaging via the actual paper? You decide to sleep after staying up that late writing each other. That is weird. What? Hmm. It appears you have grown closer to Iron. Perhaps you should talk to him and see if he needs anything. Maybe, maybe. Unius the 16th. Alright. Let's go. Grab our cup of joe on the way out. Thank you very much. Uh, Alright, coffee girl. Anything new? Recipes? Sure, yeah, of course. Alright, I see. You really like those recipes, huh? Fair enough, fair enough. So I guess we'll go and see her then? Because that was... Oh. Okay. Hey, Sal. Thanks for, hmm, thanks for helping me learn my first aura skill. I'm sure it'll be useful during combat. Okay, that's weird. Uh. Okay, I don't, I don't really know what to make of that. Hmm. Okay, I don't know if that was like bugged or like if I got the wrong text or something. Cause that I don't know. Like maybe it's only meant to show that if there's no option at night, but there's going to be one available in the morning or something. I don't know. That just seemed a little off. All right, so Iron has his option there. Which, yeah, I, I feel like... I'm still probably best to do one more of them, right? Or should I just do... Well... I mean... There's that one more class and there's another one after it, so... I think we could probably split the difference there. I mean, there's aura skills and aura breaks, I mean, so I assume if there's going to be like a, a story jump sort of thing happening... It's more likely in this one, but... Although, the only thing is, I'm not sure if this is going to be... I don't know if this is going to be a, a field trip one, you know? It could be. Hmm. Not that it necessarily matters. I should probably be aware of it. Uh... Yeah, alright, we'll do a quick save. Alright, let's see what's going on with the aura skills, eh? Aura skills. Alright, West Wing 2. Yeah, I don't know if this, this could be a field mission. It, it seems like it's... Yeah, 50-50 on that one, I feel like. Welcome everyone to today's class on aura skills. Let us begin with understanding what aura is. Can you, anyone help me enlighten this class? Enlighten the class? And I was going to say, I guess our first uh, spell one wasn't a field trip, so yeah, to be fair, this probably isn't. I'd like to give it a try, Professor. Interesting. You probably studied on your own, didn't you? Very well, let's hear it. Hello, white-haired girl with a avatar. Are you a potential party member? Hmm. Aura is composed of life energy present in all living things. It is a reflection of one's soul, and so it is unique in every person. Unlike mana, an individual can develop their own aura and use it in ways nobody else can. Okay. Impressive. That is absolutely correct. However, allow me to clarify a few things. Mana allows us to cast spells by harnessing it from our surroundings. Our bodies constantly absorb mana from nature. We can also speed up the process by more direct means, such as drinking mana potions. Aura, on the other hand, is personal. It is a manifestation of one's soul. The more you mature, the more your aura grows. Unlike spells, aura skills cannot be taught. Instead, they are developed according to your personality and life experiences. Hence, each person has their own unique set of aura skills. Okay, cool stuff, cool stuff. Um, Professor Demetrius, I already know one aura skill, but how can we learn more if you can't teach us? Good question, eh? The simple answer is, live your life. Make friends, explore the world, do new things. Living your life to the fullest allows you to grow, and as a result, so are your aura. I think I get the idea. Thank you, Fraser. Okay, aura sounds like, I don't know, my, my first thing I thought of was like Nen from um, Hunter Hunter. Like, the aura sounds far more like that compared to, you know, mana offering a more traditional magic type of thing. Not that Nen is magic, although it, you know, you know what I mean? Well, if you watch Hunter Hunter, you probably will, but if not... Anyway, I think I get the idea. Thank you, Professor. You're asking the right questions. Keep it up. One day your aura skills will determine success or failure in the field. Any other questions? None? Then let's conclude this class. I'll be giving everyone an aura potion. You are dismissed after receiving one. You have cleared the aura skills class. Okay, so we didn't actually learn any aura skills, or...? No, yeah, we got a free potion. That's something. Well, oh. What is happening? Uh... 
Uh, sure. Hey, wait up. My name's Jin. I'm glad I went here as soon as I heard someone shout for help. Let's take this thing down together. No, nope. alright, sure. You seem friendly enough for now. Uh, I probably... Oh wait, am I controlling Jin? Okay. Um, wind spell? Yeah, we could do a wind spell. Who's so Jin going to be a party member too? He did have a, he had an avatar. That gives him that. Let's defense him it up. I'm, gl I'm really glad I got the defense. I, I'm liking the defense down stuff. So I think we probably want to start most fights doing... This thing's pretty tough. Yes, it is. How come nobody is around to deal with this? Aren't the Keepers supposed to be guarding the Academy? That'd be a good question. Um, I was about to say, so I think we should start most fights using defense twice, because you get the double arrow. Wait, so Shuma stacks twice, but not more than that. I mean, I, you know, seems like the way to go. <laughs> so yeah, you get the double arrow there. So you, I don't know how that works exactly, but it seems to indicate stacking it, so... <laughs> hey, I have an idea. Why don't you show me your aura skills? Maybe we could use your skills to beat this guy. Well, you don't... You can't do yours yet. Alright, your AP's down, I see. Alright, we'll keep doing... Enero? Enero? Sure. Enero? One of them. Uh, I, I don't have any aura skills, actually. Like, seriously, am I supposed to have an aura skill? That's a little weird, right? That he would say that, unless it's gonna... Okay, we'll see if it comes up. <laughs> Because otherwise it's a little strange. <laughs> Maybe we'll learn one from this battle? Oh, there we go. Hey, what do you mean you don't have any aura skills? I thought everyone here had at least one. Okay, listen. Give me an aura potion. I'll do my best to take this golem out. Uh, wait, do you have enough already? Well, oh, fine. Have your aura potion. Feels like I'm wasting it. That's fine, though. I'll keep beefing it up. Fine, may as well just keep the defense stack on. Although, ooh, my health's down a little actually. Alright, go, do you use your launcher. Show me how awesome it is. Oh damn, that was actually pretty good. <laughs> okay, touche. That was pretty good. That's your boo. Thanks for helping me, that was close. Ask how she feels. I think I'm alright. A few scratches here and there, but nothing serious. I'm Linnell, by the way. Nice to meet you, Linnell. Oh. Maybe safe. I think we should go to the infirmary and have you checked. You should come with us in case any of those things show up again. I don't think I can fend off a golem all alone. Okay, I like this guy. He was helpful, and he's not a douchebag. <laughs> he's like, I mean, in, in a modest way, I mean. Like, the fact that he's, like, saying for us to come and that he couldn't fend one himself, like, you know. It's a, it's a very, it could have had a very different attitude there. He's cool. You and Jean accompany Linnell to the infirmary. Hello. I still can't believe someone got attacked by a monster inside the academy grounds. I know that sometimes they manage to get inside, but the law majors on duty usually deal with them before they can cause any trouble. Yeah, where was the person who was meant to be outside that, uh, the dorm there? Like, shouldn't they have kind of dealt with that? I'm glad you helped us. Yeah. Oh. No problem. Any decent foxhound would have done the same. I just happened to be in the right place at the right time. By the way, you look kind of familiar. Have we met before? Uh, homeroom class. Oh yeah, I think I saw you there. I guess I'm not very memorable. <laughs> you know, there's a reason why I was late. On my way to class, I saw a monster cornering a candidate just like what happened today. Sircon saw it too, but he just gave it a glance and walked straight to the main building. No one else was there to help, so I had no choice but to fend off the monster. That's why I was late for class. Vakana! I just don't get that guy. Why didn't he help that candidate? There's something strange going on at this academy, and I bet Sircon has something to do with it. I agree. I do, I do. Right, it doesn't take a genius to notice that there are weird things happening here. Indeed, my friend, indeed. Anyway, I'll do some digging on my own. See you around. Take care of yourself, Sal. You too, buddy, you too. Alright, alright, you seem cool. Back to night time. Alright. Alright, so you don't have anything to say again? I'll still say hello. How you doing, Alyssa? Alyssa seemed nervous about something. Yes, yeah, that's that's weird. Like, what's... Um, hi, Sal. I was just thinking about talking to you too, but I'm too tired right now. Are you available tomorrow morning? I'll clear my schedule for you just in case. They're just going to say the same thing? Yeah. So that's weird. Why why would it say something 
so specific and have like the blue text highlighted and she's nervous about something yet it didn't progress like that definitely seems like there could be a little bug going on with the triggers there or something hmm all right let's just do a quick save for good measure yes thank you very much um i guess we're good i mean should we write to iron maybe make some money uh do i have any new friends to bond with well, yeah, we may as well write, I figure. Maybe, yeah, why not? You received a note from mine. Hi, Sile, I have something to tell you about a rather talky person. See you soon, okay? Uh, okay. Is that the same as her, then? Like, I... Is that sort of the same message? Like... Okay. He didn't have any blue text, though. I don't know. Alright, uh... I guess I can do a job? They, they don't seem that profitable. Alright, I'm glad to find you here to keep things tidy. They only get like, what, 60 gold or something? You begin arranging books on shelves. You send Dusty off the furniture. Oh, right, it did say something about paying me more or something, didn't it? Oh, okay, so maybe it's 180 per now, all right. That's not bad, I mean, considering we have no, like nothing. 17. Ah, uh, really? God damn it. All right, well, I do have an espresso, so keep that in mind. And, well, actually, yeah, I guess this thing is, if you get a cup of coffee every day, that means every three days you can make an espresso. So that's, that actually works out pretty well, doesn't it? Hmm, okay. Hmm, okay. So there might be something to keep using if we can. Okay, let's check this. Greetings, the item craft room is now over. Oh, same? No, oh, I wonder why that was, uh, alright. Odd. All good, though. Alright, still nothing with Alyssa there. Grab these logs. Check the cafe, even though I'm quite certain it's not open. Yes, Junius, no idea where you are, but it's fine. Um, anyone hanging around? Well, I guess, yeah, Iron. So I don't know if that's like, yeah, just the message that comes up because there's no more nighttime things with him right now, or... I'm a bit confused on that because, especially with how, with her, it seemed like some of the text was repetitive, so I don't know if there's a limit of how many times you can bond within a certain period, or... Kind of hard to say. Alright, so it doesn't seem like Jin or the other girl is around here anywhere for us to talk to them further. Thought maybe they could be. Um... Okay, nothing going on there. All right, well, what do we want to do? Uh, I guess we'll check in here first. I just thought maybe they'd be around somewhere, but maybe not. Mm, quick peek in the library, I think. And then I guess we'll go to iron. I don't know, it's hard to say about that text. If it was just saying it that way, or if he actually has something that's going to be unique, or if it's just a normal bonding thing, or... Alright, well everything's looking pretty normal in here. Alright. Let's go to iron and then I assume we only have the one class we can do at the moment now too, right? Uh, yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, although we don't have any aura skills, like I thought we would have learned one in that battle maybe or something. Or, or from that class. Well, I guess no, because I mean they come naturally I suppose. So not as much so, but... After the explanation, but... I thought maybe in that fight, that would have been a fitting sort of situation to learn one in. Uh, yes, let's go to Ayn then. That's fine. How you doing, Ayn? Yo. Hey, Sal, want to hang out today? Sure. Huh. Cool, it's good to take it easy every now and then. That it is, that it is. And some tea is also good every now and then. It's a good thing that you're free today, Sal. I was getting bored messing around with Potion. So how have you been? I bet you know a lot of spells already, huh? Yeah, I'm pretty great. <laughs> I knew it. You've always been a fast learner. It's a little, little casual bragging. As for me, I only know a few. I'm having a hard time learning new spells, to be honest. You know how much I struggled in school back when we were kids, right? Oh, you'll get there, buddy. But I found a way to compensate. I've been reading the book on martial arts. Martial arts? Huh. Yeah, I figured if I'm not good with spells, I can always rely on my fists to defend myself. No? Well, sure, why not? Think of it this way, at least I won't need as much mana to be useful, right? Want to see what I've learned so far? Sure. Oh. Okay, get ready. 
Ein starts punching the air as fast as he can. He looks clumsy. Ein is slowing down. He looks like he's getting exhausted. Huff Huff, what do you think? Uh, need, needs improvement. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Gotta be honest. Is that bad, huh? You're getting there, but I knew it. I knew I couldn't do it even if I tried. I'm not, no, I'm just saying you need some improvement, buddy. First I failed Postcraft 101 and now I can't even perfect a stupid punching technique. Maybe I really shouldn't be in Law Magic Academy after all. Oh man, this guy's a, <laughs> he's all over the place, isn't he? I believe in you, buddy. I was saying, I said you need improvement, but you know, you're getting there. You really think I can do it? Even though I fail at the most basic things, you still think I can pull this off? I do. Thanks, Sal, that means a lot to me. Hmm, let me think. What if I use a bit of magic to help me stabilize my form? Sounds like a plan. Okay, I have an idea. I think it's gonna work this time. Stand back, style. Watch me. I'm gonna break something. Very good. Even got the aria. <laughs> I did it, style. I really did this time. I learned the aura skill. Flurry. Oh, awesome. All right. Oh man, I'm literally shaking right now. I can't believe I actually did this. I'm proud of you. Hey, yeah, buddy. Very proud. Ah, <laughs> oh, thanks. Pretty awesome, hey. Hey Sal, thanks for helping me believe in myself more. I was pretty sure I wasn't capable of learning anything new, but because of you I'm starting to get more confidence now. You're a good friend, you know that? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. You spend the rest of the night, uh, you spend the rest of the day laughing with Iron and talking about all the cool things you could possibly do. Yeah, sure, why not? And home for the night. Uh, you wanna hang out at all? Nope. I'm guessing you got the same message. It's, it's weird, because you're like, it's not, it's not like a generic message, you know, like the fact that she's nervous, you got the blue text, and she references the morning, it's like a, it's like a combo of things, you know. I'm guessing this is going to be the same again too, isn't it? You received a note from mine. Uh, sorry, Sal, I have a backlog of readings I need to finish, maybe next time? Yeah. So I guess, I don't know, because I mean, at least with Ayn, I don't know, the last one, I don't know. The last one made a bit more sense because he still had a thing to talk about. Whereas now it's changed and he doesn't have maybe a thing tomorrow. But then with her, like, and especially with the blue text as well, and the fact that the nervous stuff, like, uh, I don't get that. Oh, right, I'm tired, aren't I? I forgot about that. Uh, all right, maybe I'll, I'll do a job tonight and then have an espresso in the morning. And just hopefully not get sick. Because I don't know the, I don't know the chances of getting sick or how exactly that works, but we, we could actually use a little extra cash, so <laughs> probably worth it. Jim we'll get 180 again? Yep, alright, well, that brings us back up to 360, I think. I think we, because we got down, we, yeah, we were right on zero, weren't we? Alright, very good. Please don't get sick and we can have an espresso. <laughs> you feel tired? Yes, I thought so. Alright, let's have an espresso then, why not? So we can make some more. We can make two more, in fact. That's very good. That is all clear, yes. Oops. Yep, very good. Alright, well, we can make two more with one to spare, so that's not bad at all. Alright. Very good. Anything new with you? Yep, no, alright, nothing there. Alright. Uh, I guess we'll check Iron. I'm assuming maybe he's done as well, though. Hard to say. Hmm. Probably. If, if it does, yeah, okay. So I'm guessing that she might be bugged. Um, I'm get like, well, I still find it strange that she has the whole nervous part and it's in blue, but at the same time, if she did have an activity, like an activity, a, a little hangout bubble thingy, it would probably still make sense. So maybe what's happening is we saw Ayn's, like the two versions of when talking to Ayn via the paper, the one that said, um, whatever it was. And then the one last night, uh, about the backlog of reading. So now we don't have a thing. So maybe hers isn't checking properly and it's always showing the one like she does have a thing, even though she doesn't. So it's just displaying the wrong message, maybe? I don't know, that, that, that seems like a possibility at least. Uh, but since that's the case, uh, nothing for iron there. Um, I guess, I guess we'll go to the crafting first. We may as well make those espressos, because they'll be useful one way or another. And better to have them, you know, now rather than forget about it. So I think we'll do that, and then... I guess we have to do class after that, right? I don't, I don't think there's anything else going on that I can think of. Right, let's make you two of those, very good. Oh, we're getting down on the clear water, eh? 
Do we want to make another one of them, or...? It's fine. Uh... Nothing we want to buy from you, is there? Maybe some clear water? I mean, they are cheap here. We're gonna need more. Let's just buy a few of them. Uh... Yeah, so we can't buy we can't buy any weapons crafting stuff of him still. Maybe after the next class, like another story, you know, bump forward or open that up or something. All right. Um, yeah, I think we're. Uh... Oh, what was that? Maybe after finishing our basic classes, more areas will become accessible to us. Maybe. Hmm. All right. Um, I don't think there's anything else, right? This class. Um. Do 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 do. Just a, yeah, no, no, no. Okay, we're good. We're good. We can go to class, and I can have some tea. So I assume. Well, this might be a field mission. Hard to say. It is with Zelka Sensei, so definitely could be. Oh yeah, this class is a field mission and required to go outside of the academy for a few days. Are you prepared to take this class? Um. We should have enough potion. Well. Um. Well, 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 well. We could make. I don't know, like if we wanted to grind a little. I, I didn't end up doing much of that last time, even though I said about it, but it could be worth at least a little bit. So I don't know. It probably wouldn't hurt to do like a couple more uh, mana potions, if anything. Um. Yeah, like I, I feel like we may as well do that. Health potions? Why not? Let's just make them up. It's not, it's not a ton still, but we might as well. Antidote? Would be good to probably have, actually. If we deal with anything with poison... Oh, how much do wood roots cost? I don't want to actually buy them, because they're a drop, but... It probably would be good to have... Let's get a couple more of them. It'd be good to have at least a couple of antidotes. Yeah, just in case. Cause I don't know, like if poison holds after the matches and it will be a problem, like, so could be worth having. Although I assume we'll be able to bring iron this time. So we'll actually have a party of three to work with. So that'll be good. Like, I'm just thinking like without coins, it might be worth getting a little bump. Not, not a major grind or anything, just enough to push us up a little further. Um, okay, just, just in case I'm missing anything, I'm gonna do a quick save. Okay, we should be good to go. I don't think I forgot anything, but, you know, that's why saves are there. This class is a field mission and required you go outside the academy for a few days. Are you prepared to take this class? Yes, I am. Very well. Please proceed to West Wing 4. Alright, so, is it going to be... Who have we got in our class here? Anyone else familiar? Uh, okay, yeah, because that's the thing, like, so... Yeah, like, Ayn and Alyssa aren't actually showing in this class, but I assume we can take them with us, so... I don't know. Settle down, noobs. We'll now begin the lesson on Aura Breaks. Now that you have a basic understanding of Aura, it's time for you to learn how to use your enemy's Aura against them. Cultivating your Aura generally makes you stronger. It determines your strengths and capabilities. But it is worth mentioning that your Aura determines your weaknesses as well. As your Aura grows, you will develop new abilities as well as new weaknesses. Now some of you might not have weaknesses yet. If you're one of them, that's because you are already weak for not having your, grown your aura. <laughs> Fair enough. Everyone has weaknesses, but we don't die easily because our aura shield protects us. Oh, so that's what that is. If you get hit by something you're weak against, your aura shield cracks, so to speak. Allow me to demonstrate. You there, you will have the honor of having your aura shield broken by me. Now stand still, pay attention, class. That's what it looks like when you get hit by something you're weak against. If you get hit enough times with your weakness, you'll experience what we call an aura break. <laughs> Poor guy. When you're in a state of aura break, you'll be stunned and take additional damage. This is precisely what you want to do to your opponents. You must hit them enough times with their weaknesses. After two turns, your opponent will recover their aura shields, so it's best to finish them off while they're down. Ah, okay, okay. Interesting. For a second there, I thought I was a goner. <laughs> take note that individuals have different aura shield durabilities. Most magical creatures can only take a few hits. However, stronger creatures can take much more. Creatures. 
That is why it is important for you to improve your aura. Not only will you have more skills to use, but you will also develop resistance. Now for the practical exam. In order for you to pass this class, you'll have to go to, uh, Zoklat Hills? Your mission is to find me. Okay. Uh, Zolat Hills is more dangerous than Arashia Forest. The monsters are stronger and more aggressive. However, you are not allowed to leave up until you find me, so you have to look everywhere. If you want to stay alive, do your best to exploit monsters' weaknesses and perform aura breaks. Oh, something I did forget actually is buying maybe a couple of uh, element things. Because, I mean, Alyssa has the water one, but we don't have a fire... I think I might have a couple of items left, but yeah, the fire and earth things in case we have any boulders or the... Uh, bushes to burn for chests or something. Hmm. So that's something to keep in mind. Uh, I think we might have one and two of them though. I don't remember exactly. Traversing through Zol Zolklat will not be as easy, will not be an easy task. I suggest you bring some friends with you. Now go, I'll see you at Zolklat Hills. Yes ma'am. Alright. So I guess you yeah, even though they're not in the class, they can come with us. Which I don't know why they didn't just show in the class. Like, it seems to be a multi-door class type of thing, so... I don't know, it feels like it would make sense if we, they were in there with us type of thing. Um, because it feels like it, it makes most sense if your group's going out of, out of school for a field mission would... You know, it would make most sense that they would actually be in class with you, because... Like, it's a multiple day trip, so... Having friends who aren't in the class come along with you, that, that doesn't seem very realistic for a school, you know what I mean? Like, just having them just help out someone else for two, three days on a mission that isn't for them, even though they're going to have to also do this class some other time, or, you know what I mean? I, I don't know. Heading out to Zol Collect Hills, eh? Best be careful out there. That place isn't as tame as Arashia Forest, kiddo. You might want to bring some friends with you, too. Never know what sort of magic creatures you might jump into. So you're ready? Uh, invite? Are they already... Are they... Uh, what do you want to do, kid? Invite. Alyssa is already in your party. Do you want to remove her? No. What do you want to do, kid? Invite. Ayn is already in party. Do you want to remove him? No. So, that's fine then? I guess? Right then. Good luck, kiddo. I don't know. That, I, I think that UI could use some tweaks, maybe. I don't know. I, I feel like I... There's nothing to indicate they're in my party already. Like... Or maybe there is, and it'll be more noticeable when I have... Like... I guess if you have more than, I guess you can have four in a party, so if we had like an extra two people, then it would be maybe the names, like one of the names would actually be greyed out and I'd be able to tell more or something. I don't know, at, at the moment it throws me off a little. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, right, so just to double check that, right here, so we have um, two end guys and one end burn, so that, that could be fine then. I just, yeah, uh, I did forget about them though. Alright, well, let's uh, get to doing stuff. Oh, I like that we're all... Uh, walking around together, like it shows everyone. That's cool. Uh, spells? Well, we have a fair few potions, so... The three of us, that should help. Um... We should do normal attacks. I do the fire dagger now, it's nice. I don't know, lightning? Maybe, I don't know, I don't know how conserved I should be with mana, you know. Probably don't need to be too bad. Okay, so it's, it's shield went down one then, so does that mean it was weak to lightning, or...? Alright, so what is it here, Noblesse? Deals three, slash attacks to an enemy. Let's, uh, let's give that a shot then. Can I select? Yes. Let's see how that does. Oh, oh, nice, wow. Okay, that was, that was pretty good then. Yes, I still have no aura skills, I guess. Oh, no, so, okay, well that broke the shield as well, so okay, maybe... Okay, I'm not quite sure. Hmm. Oh, wow, all right. He did a fair bit of damage with a normal attack there. Oh, 90, very nice. I guess you do do a lot more damage maybe when the aura shield's broken. Okay. Uh, right, we have a save thingy over there. Yeah, I don't know how big this area is going to be. I guess we just have to plow through and find the teacher. Uh, normal, maybe? I think we were probably fine, honestly, just doing normal, aren't we? Like, uh, yeah. Because as long as we're just using basically mana to heal up in between, I, I think that'll that'll be an alright sort of cost-benefit type thing. 40 XP, 40 gold, got a stinger. So I mean that 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 ugh, that one fight like of a few of them covers a a mana potion, so it's really not bad in that way. 
And I have my end heal, which I'm very glad to have gotten. Yeah, I think that'll be good. Alright. Uh, so definitely nothing here, right? Because like, that was... Didn't really, yeah. Alright. No hidden items or anything, I guess. Uh, what do we got? Save thingy. Uh, I guess we'll do that. Drop a quick save. Very good. Oh my goodness, it's... It's up to 11 and a half hours now. <laughs> uh, crazy. Uh, what do we got down here? Something juicy? Gold ring. That That is kind of juicy. I mean, in a money way. What are you two doing? Lovebirds or fighting? We all know that we can use our spells on field obstacles, right? However, some people don't know they can also use shards to get past them. I have some spare shards with me, actually. You can have them. Oh, thank you. Yami. Thank you very much. Don't forget to use your aura skills if you have any. Things are going to get tougher from here. Alright, Yami. Very nice. Thank you. I asked around for some tips before enrolling in this class. My friends told me that golems are weak to water. I hope you find this tip helpful. I... maybe. Are we going to be fighting golems? I'll... I'll keep it in mind. Uh, let's fight this thing. I don't know how... I don't know about grinding or not. Uh, either way, we'll just try and at least make sure we kill everything. I more want to have the option there, like enough mana potions if we want to stop and do a bit of that. Um... You know, I, I just like to have the resources, which, you know, we get gold, EXP, and items we can use for crafting, so it definitely seems a, a benefit. Uh, but, I, but I also think that that's sort of my full game mindset bleeding in. Like, I have to remember that this is a demo, and even though I don't want to, you know, it doesn't take away from the experience, like, I still want to play it in full. But I, I don't necessarily need to be doing the type of grinding that I would if I was playing this as a full game, you know? So, that, that's probably something for me to keep in mind. Alright, got a nice open area here. Hello. I'm having trouble deciding where to go. The Western Pass is infested with monsters. I'd love to go train there, but I'm traveling alone. On the other hand, the Eastern Path has fewer monsters, which is it safer. But I won't get stronger if I play safe all the time. Indeed. I say we take the western path. We could rack up plenty of experience and raise our grade. No. Actually, we would be exposing ourselves to unnecessary risks by going west. We should take the eastern path, Sile. Our mission is to simply find Law Mage Zelka. We won't be able to do that if we let monsters slow us down. Oh. Yeah, but it wouldn't hurt to raise our grade along the way, beating up some monsters, right? Oh well, I'll follow you wherever you decide to go, Sile. Oh, I'm thinking west. I I'm, I'm all for EXP, you know? Uh, I mean, ideally, I would like to go both ways, so... You know... I don't know if that's possible, like, can we track most of the one way, then head back and do the other? Like, that, that would be my actual choice. Uh, anything here before we head out? Uh, doesn't look like it. Alright, let's go west then. We'll definitely try, I don't know if it's going to lock us out or something, like, odd, you know. Otherwise, we'll definitely come back and go east, like, you know, don't want to miss out on treasure chests or anything good. But yeah, we'll see how we go. I am, I gotta say, I, I remain, like, quite shocked at how large this demo is. I mean, what am I at now? So, the first three parts made three and a half hours. The last one was, like, 40 minutes. That's, like, what, four, you know, 410. My record says 50 now, so... Uh, I mean, it's probably a tiny bit less, but around five hours then. Or, yeah, around five hours it would be. Probably just, just on ish five hours, like pretty close to that. And I'm at what, day 18? I've forgotten what day it was. I think it might have been 18, right? And this is going to take a couple, so I guess by the end of this field mission, we'll be around halfway through the amount of days that there are. I can't imagine it would amount to half the content though, because otherwise that would mean like a 10 hour demo for me. Which, yes, I play slower and I tend to repeat and do things and check things that others may not, but... My god, like a 10 hour demo? That would be absurd. I mean, honestly, 5 hour demo is already pretty crazy. And, I mean, like, if we're only at half thing, I mean, guarantee... And I'm saying that based on finishing this area. We still have to actually get through the area before that can really be, you know? So, even if there was only, like, 2 hours more, like, the, the next... Like, rather than five hours for 20, we only get t two hours worth. That would still make for a seven-hour demo at this point. Like, uh, that that on that on its own is very impressive, but also makes me wonder, god damn, how many hours would the full game take for me to get through? <laughs> uh, that could be uh, a bit crazy. 
I like it though. I'm I'm all for long games. It's just like kind of crazy. Uh, so we guess this splits and then it splits again. Oh, golem, hello. All right, so there's a bit going on here apparently. Leave it to me, Sal. Oh, very nice. Oh, all right. I didn't even realize that was a roadblock then. I was about to try and go around it. Okay. Well, that works. And we have that. All right. I just want to sort of be careful not to jump on story. I mean, jump ahead from story. Make sure we check things, kill everything, you know, that type of stuff. But yeah, I was just saying, like, yes, the demo size is very impressive. That's for sure. Like, it's kind of crazy, honestly. <laughs> Let me do it, Sal. I'm not even sure what you're doing. Oh. Oh, all right. That, I mean, I knew there'd be something way to get up here, but man, that's... It feels a little easy to miss, that thing on the ground there. It just sort of blends in naturally. Hello there. I will be fighting them, but... Other things first. Can we walk through here? Nope. Okay. And does this go off into another area? Probably... No? Oh, we have a save up here. Very good. I like saves. That is good. Very good. Although, yeah, I mean, if this does go for, like, 10 hours, god damn, that is really crazy. <laughs> it really is, like... I mean, I said, I, I'm definitely slower, I think, about it, but... Yeah, that's definitely... I don't know, I don't know if you need that much, like... I guess it doesn't hurt, though, does it? Like... I mean, to the saying it doesn't need that much, it's more of a conventional thinking thing. There's no reason you can't do a demo that's half your game if you want to, like... You know? It's <laughs> like... Yeah. So, I certainly don't mind, it's, just, it's surprising. Although, I will say, it does make me hope that, if anything, well, I guess it depends how how developed the game actually is and all of this, but I feel like the longer the demo, the more it would also make me hope that the demo does allow you to continue on. Um, I mean, the full game allow you to continue on from your demo save type of thing. Because I feel like the more of the game I play, the more I wouldn't want to replay it, even if I really enjoyed it sort of thing, because I, I just, I mean, it's more me though, but yeah. Hello there, interested in buying some potions? No. If you say so, don't be shy to come back if you're done. I will, I will. Thank you. I appreciate your service. But no, I'm good. Um, let's make sure we... Oh, is that a... Is that an area or just a... Nope, alright. Alright, so we've got another one of them there. We will actually fight all them. We've just been, uh... Want to collect things and such first. Oh, were there five? Nice. Alright. And was this anything? It almost looked like a... Okay, it's nothing. Um... I guess that's all clear then? So I don't know, like, should we fight maybe these golems and then go back the other way? Is that what we're sort of looking at here? Uh, maybe? Nothing else we missed? Any... Anywhere we can go? So, yeah. Oh. Uh, no, I do not. Okay, so I don't want to go that way. All right, well, let's deal with these golems. Uh, what were they weak against? Water, I think? I think it was water, wasn't it? I assume they'll be uh, a good XP, so we don't want to skip over them. I'm pretty sure it was water, though, right? I think. Yeah. And we can defim it up. And iron, you can... Oh, yeah, well, how is, uh, how's your flurry thing? Well, we'll save that for right now. Uh, how's an earth spell? Are you earth spell like not very good or maybe good? Ah, uh, that wasn't great. Okay. It's fine though. Probably just do a normal attack for Iron next. You can absolutely keep up the water. It's very good. Should knock down the green. Yes, very good. Uh, yeah, we can stack the defense again. Yeah, I think that is the way to go either way. Like, just double. Uh, then probably normal attack for Iron at the moment. Other than that. You can do that. Yes, that was not bad. Wait, was that a double attack or not? I couldn't... It looked like a no number come up full of 26. So that was either good or not good. <laughs> uh, either way. And go that again. Ooh. Sal needs a heal, actually. That knocked me down a bit further than I was realizing. Give a little buff. Very good. Okay, that's not a, that's not a huge heal, that is it. And... So is that double? Oh, is that me? It looks like... It's like a number comes up that I don't know if it's just like it changes or I can't quite tell. Hmm. Okay. And Sile is going to need another heal. Uh. Well, no, we probably we can get away with at least a round, right? Uh. Normal attacks fine. Ooh, very nice. And sure, let's do one of them. 
How's that do? Ooh, nice. I don't know how that, how does AP actually work? Does it just go up every turn a little bit, I guess? Um, sure, let's do one of them as well. Smash it up. Oh, okay, so she gained nine AP back for doing that attack. That's interesting. Hmm. Ooh, so close. Oh, so close again. Come on, one more. Little smack. Oh, come on, what's going on here? There we go. Uh, 80 Gs, very nice. Great up for all of us. Very nice. Wait, no, we already seven? No, either way, we're all seven now, so that is good. Whatever order it happened in. And some heals all around for everyone. Oop, MP down. Uh, what do we want to do? Ooh, do, do. Getting there. Mana potion, thank you. And, alright, that's fine. Uh, golems, where were you? Was it, was it three of them total, or? Four. One here. Oh no, this must be four. Alright. Oh, okay, this is one of the bees as well, alright. Uh, you go with that. I really, yeah, I'm, I'm really liking the battlefield. I also said four, but like, now that there's actually like three characters, and there'll be four, presumably, uh, I am liking how it's laid out. It's really good. It, um, I don't know what it reminds me of. Something. Hmm. Either way, I like it. <laughs> like, it's not um, anything crazy. Like, it's pretty traditional, I guess. Like, but no, I, I don't think it's one I'd get sick of sort of thing. Uh, it's good. Um, what am I doing here? Uh, maybe that. Um, I also like that it's um, I don't know. I think it combines well with the fact that you do see all of the enemies on the overworld. Like, you're not dealing with random encounters. That's definitely a big plus for me. Like, I, I feel like the day of random encounters should have. It should be passed, you know. I don't think we, I don't think we really need them anymore. <laughs> like, they they sort of serve their purpose, like more for a functional reason, even though they've become so like staple in a sense for JRPGs especially. But yeah, I don't know. They they tend to just not be fun. I find the longer you play. But I, but I think I also have a really bad attention span, so you know that that probably impacts it quite a bit. I would say. I don't know. I don't know, I, I found like, um, particularly like some, um, there's been like a couple of SNES JRPGs that I've just, um, cheesed the combat on and really enjoyed myself playing, like, um, just setting it so, like doing a, what do you call them? Uh, ROM hack. No, ROM, ROM hack, but that is not even close to the right thing I'm thinking of. <laughs> uh, just like a, a game chart code is what I'm thinking of, I can't think of the actual name for SNES though, or what it would be. I think I was thinking wrong hack, ROM hack, god damn it. Um, but yeah, like adding a thing that makes you deal like 9999 damage or something, so that every fight's just G's. I, I've, I've really enjoyed a few old RPGs like that because of, it's sort of taken out that grind and let me just enjoy the world and stories. Like other, other games I embrace the combat on, obviously, but there is some older ones that it's, it makes for a surprisingly fun experience, but it, it also makes for a shocking experience when you realize just how many hours actually get end up being devoted to just that combat like there, there's a few that i've played where you know i mean like if you're familiar with the website like how long to beat.com where you can submit like game time and stuff I, I usually check that like it's not one to submit to or anything but I, I check it occasionally when i'm playing games just out of curiosity usually i end up taking way longer than the times than that whereas like for some of the rpgs i've done that with my time ends up like anywhere between like a half and a third of the average time like it it's really crazy just how much some of those games you actually spend on the the battles like it, it's yeah it's crazy i think that the exception stuff for me like you know like dragon quest can be like that as well but i love dragon quest so i've never done that with one of them but like i, I did that with um i did that with final fantasy 6 for example but I never played that as a kid, like that was my first, like I loved that, that was that was a great experience, but you know, I'd, I'd completely cheese the combat for that. Which I'm sure definitely took away some of the experience, but it's such a grindy game I found in that regard with, I mean not grindy, I mean, there's just too many random encounters for my liking, or at least when I was wanting to play it, but um, just sort of cheesing that and just sort of embracing the combat as like, you know, just a part of the story type of thing, um, man, it's such a good experience, like, it, the pacing was so good too, like, that game, I don't know, at least it was only, I played it once, and I played it without combat, so I can't speak to, you know, the normal experience, I suppose, but 
cheesing the combat so it just breezed through and didn't worry about random encounters and stuff. I think I may have... I don't know if I disabled random encounters or... Maybe that's what... I think I... Maybe I did that as well. I think I, it might have been that I disabled random encounters and I did the 999 thing. Uh, one or the other, or both. I mean, yeah, something like that. But it, it made the pacing, like, so good. Like, it made it a short experience. Like, I, I imagine it was a fundamentally different thing to, like, you know, people who played it in childhood or something, but it, it was still really good. Like, I, I loved it. It's definitely one I want to play again, though, because, like, it, it was an incredible experience, but because I played it like that, and it was also sort of a binge playthrough, my memory of it isn't great. It's It, it was really binge. Like, I played it in two days, so... It was an incredible experience to play it like that. It really was, but it was it was very much an in the moment experience. Like, yeah, uh, my memory didn't re retain that well of uh, a lot of it. But oh shit, that was the wrong one. That's fine though. Anyway, that's my little ramble about that. <laughs> Don't even know how that started, but that's fine. I think we have. Uh, do we have one more left? Yeah, one more. I don't even honestly know if this is worth it, but I, I figure why not? You know, <laughs> may as well get the XP and such that we can. I may just ramble, ramble my way through the last one, so they're not too bad to fight anyway. Oh, I didn't realize, is that what that is down the bottom there? Like, that's their weaknesses? Ah, so I guess you learn them the more you fight, or you have to discover them maybe? Ah, I wasn't realizing that, okay, that's interesting. I probably have noticed that before, I just forgot or something today. But yeah, so they, these are weak to the, yeah, okay. I like that system. Alright, that's cool. Very good. And I think, uh, I think we'll do a save after this fight, and then we'll go back and see if we can go east. Because there could definitely be chests or anything else. Or maybe there's other stuff we want to fight. Um, which, to be fair, might somewhat make what we're doing here redundant if they all just reset. But, you know, that's fine. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're doing pretty well so far. I mean, health-wise and all that stuff. Been smacked a bit by golems. Not sure why they're existing around here, but sure. It's fine. Very good. Um, you know what? You can do that. It's fine. Bees and golems. Very, very normal enemies. Uh, I guess let's try this against you. Did we find other weaknesses, or maybe? I can't tell if that was weak or not. Uh, what are we doing here? Water. Very good. Uh, I wish I had more tea. Really enjoying that. Should have made a larger one. I think I'll make another one after this mission. Although I, I think we'll be wrapping up this episode after this mission, I imagine. So since like the last one was a like 40-45. I haven't actually rendered it yet. Because I was playing not long ago. But this one's already over at an hour, so I was trying to sort of keep uh doing a couple and do them a little bit shorter, but it's fine. Alright, we're a good. And that is this area clear, even though, yes, again, we, we might just be resetting it, but that's fine. It's good to still clear the golems. Although the golems may not reset, like, of all things. Um, is, is there anything we should be doing? Is this just a... Just an arbitrary border, or... Seems like it. Alright, that's fine. Should we check what the other way is? I mean, because this was described as the hard way, basically. So I don't know if it's going to be like... Don't turn back now, Sal. Let's face all the monsters and keep moving forward. Oh, okay. Fair enough. I, I thought it... I wasn't sure if that would allow me or not. Um, which yeah, is unfortunate, because like there's chests here, so... Like, three of them. So does that mean we missed stuff the other way? And we can't go there anyway, so it's not like it matters, but... Um, it looks like we're all good here, though. I think we've beat everything. No other places to go or anything. Okay. I think we're uh, I think we're all good. Do that, and we can head up here. Uh, oh shit! I was gonna say we probably should do a quick heal first, but that's fine. Other than that, sounding like a dragon. Oh no, it's a it's an orc, I think. Wow, all right, I like the art there. Although I think it's again, it's a good example showing sort of the somewhat fuzziness that is on our characters compared to like how crisp that looks, which. I really love how that looks, and again, I, I really like the art style of our characters. I, I just think that they need to be up a little, like, uh, sharpened a bit. But anyway, that aside. Um, oh, wow, he's got a seven, alright. Uh, let's do a noblesse, let's see how that goes. Cut him up, do your thing, Lissa. 
Yeah, I don't know why she has self-doubt. I mean, well, anyone can have self-doubt, but I mean, she, she's uh, she's awesome, so yes. I don't think she has too much to worry about, at least. You know, it's, it's natural yeah. to worry, but, you know, doesn't mean she needs to be. And it looks like that was weak, so that's also good. And right. uh, what about that? That is also weak. All right, nice. Looks like we have two weak attacks against this guy. Uh, I guess we could try nature. What do you think of nature, Mr. Oh, yeah. Any thoughts on it? Oh, and that's also weak. Very nice. All right. Uh, how's our health doing? Good enough that I can do another one of these. And maybe give Alyssa a heal on the next turn. Uh, yeah, let's do another one of them. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have any problems here. Like, th these are... Yeah. And nice dodge there, Alyssa. Very nice. Uh, I guess we can do one of them next turn. Oh, yeah, that'll be good. We knock down the green thing and we can do one of them attacks. That'll be very good. Uh, health is still actually fine. So we probably, yeah, we probably want to do attack while we've got that broken green thingy. Oh, wow, yeah, that is so much more, doesn't it? Uh, this is probably, I don't know if, it, yeah, no, that's not, well, I don't know, is it better to do aura thingy, or is it better to do a weak spell? Let's do, let's do that, since that's, that's probably better, right? I don't know. Oh, either way, that was great, so... It's fine. And now we can combine the two. Weakness and aura. How's that? Pretty good. Not, that was similar to his though. That didn't really help a ton more. Uh, health wise we're still actually okay. Let's just uh, smack him up. Oh damn. Holy shit. Alright. <laughs> Very good. Oh is that. Hmm. Alright. Can I. Uh... Let's heal before we move on I guess. I thought that was going to be like a story moment. I guess we're still continuing forward. Uh, oh, okay. We're still, still moving on, alright. I checked every nook and cranny of the western path. I'm absolutely sure Law Mage Zelka isn't there. I took the eastern path and even triple checked the whole area, but I couldn't find Law Mage Zelka there. Hmm, is that right? Three shrooms, delicious. So wait, does this go back to the east way? Which, uh, okay. Um... So where are we, where do we go? Is this a... Uh... Oop. I guess we'll check this way first. I don't know if they connect up or... I think this will be the final area or we'll load into somewhere else or... We'll see. Get these guys down. How are we doing? Ah, uh, your MP's getting down a little again. That's fine. And very good. Delicious. Some more wood. Always good. Uh, something seems strange about this tree. Okay. That might be something to k keep in mind. Does this just wrap around to... Okay, good, good. Don't want to miss anything. Uh, that looks like a way to go. I don't want to... I'm so, caught, I'm so like, paranoid about jumping story ahead. Wait, because we can't even save now, can we? Or can we go back this way? Oh, yeah, so we can't even save now. Okay, uh... I don't know if this tree is going to be like, you know, is that the proper way to go? And, or or that'll be a dead end, so the tree's the proper way to go. You know what I mean? But this could be the story way. Ah. It's awkward. Okay. Do I try and use one of these, maybe? Or... No? Okay. Hmm. Okay, I guess I'll go this way first. Couldn't use a fire thing, so... Okay. Nice little area. How are you two doing? Golems here are tough. Good thing I brought a lot of Anaqua shards from Kadir before taking this class. Indeed. It's a shame that I didn't bring some shards today. I could have dealt with those boulders and bushes on the way there. Indeed, indeed. Okay, that's another way to go. Oh, put some wood up here. Oh, and another little area here, which is not the way to get to that. Very good. Five clear water, delicious. I will take it. Yeah, let's fight you for good measure. There's a decent amount of fights here, so I don't think we'll actually like stop and grind, but we'll just sort of make sure we clear all the areas. I think that's decent enough. I mean, I said we could still grind, and I think that if this was a full game, I probably would. 
but I think honestly from this we're going to get enough XP and gold and you know, like if there was a particular thing crafting wise we wanted it might be but yeah no, I, I, so I think that that's fine enough for now. I'm curious about that tree though. I don't know if that's just going to be, we have to backtrack to that tree maybe or if I, well no I mean I, I have the end shards. I can't imagine it would be anything else. I mean, like, you know. Unless it was a story type thing, I mean. Uh. We get down. That vines, maybe? No? Alright. Continuing this way. Oh, alright. Hmm. This seems like a confrontation. Oh, very nice. Oh, alright. I don't know, I'm just at that tree, like. Yeah, it's a bit suspicious, eh? I mean, is there anything we could do? Can we still go back this way? Okay, we still can get back to this area. Um, it's gotta be. I mean, there's nothing, right? Like, we can't use. What spells? Uh, no. Something seems strange about this tree. There's nothing else we can interact with near it. Hmm. Alright. Can we get up onto that area? No. Alright. Well, we'll just have to go to the bridge confrontation. I, I don't know. We can only assume it's something we come back to, or... I mean, because, I mean, we don't even know. We may come back to this area again for class. Like, we did... Uh, we did the combat, uh, what was it, Arashia Forest, we ended up going there twice because of the failed combat mission thing, so we certainly may come back here more than once. And what do we got here? Hello. Ah, what a lovely surprise. We were worried that you might have died in Arashia Forest, that's why we're so glad that you made Dad alive. Yeah, yeah. I forgot to thank you for helping me get high grades in combat basics, I really do appreciate it. No, this ain't having that. What do you want, Sylvia? Are you here to sabotage your grades again? <laughs> if you think this is going to end like last time, you're wrong. There's more of us this time. We're ready to fight. Wait, what? Fine, you, you weren't involved with that. That's, that's kind of weird for him to say it like that. Also, where is Pon Pon? <laughs> Seriously, we, we never actually like heard about him feeling better or like we didn't see him. Oh, come on, we're not the villains here. In fact, we're trying to help you. Surely you know that Law Mage Academy is not an ordinary school. After all, it goes so far as to put us candidates in danger. <sighs> the only danger here is you. No. We can defend ourselves against monsters just fine. Oh no, not monsters. We're referring to the experience conducted on... Enough. Turn around and go away now. I'm not going to ask you twice. Stay calm. I've had enough of this. Bazzy, will you please take out the trash? With pleasure. Yeah, yeah. Oh, what? Why are we fighting them? Ha ha ha, the monsters are in for a treat tonight. Human flesh for dinner. No, Sile. Hang in there, we're going to get some help. You want to save your progress? Ah, uh, sure. Not sure I trust that. Why is it, why is it letting me save? Oh? Hello? What's happening? We meet again, Sal. I've been waiting for you. Where am I? You're in an aura dream. As you know, life energy is present in all living things, and aura is a manifestation of that life energy. Aura protects you from harm and can even heal injuries. This makes law mages resilient enough to face magical creatures. An aura dream is a state of consciousness experienced either by highly skilled law mages or those who are on the brink of death. Uh, what should I do now? At this moment, you have a choice. You may choose to abandon this world and rest, or you may rise up and face those who threaten you. Think clearly before you answer. Uh... Bye-bye. <laughs> I want to live, as I expected. If you were to rise again, how do you wish to serve your friends? Oh! Oh! Am I choosing a class? Uh... Okay. I'm not... I'm not, uh... I'm not sure what to make of this. Ah, uh, I guess we save before it, so that's good. Um, 
Like, is this, I'm curious if this is just going to give us a spell, or is it going to be more significant than that? Like, if it's just a spell, that's not a big deal. But I don't know if it's something, is it, hmm, I guess that's probably the most likely, isn't it? We already have a heal. I feel like, strike enemies maybe? Like, I feel like we would like some power. Because our, our spells right now come in the way of healing and... Uh, the defim for defense. Although, because this is an aura dream, so maybe this is going to specifically give us an aura skill. Which, in that case, I may actually want to go heal. I, I, I find that's generally pretty damn useful. Survivability can always get you through, you know? Yeah, and we, we are always going to be in a party, so I think being able to heal has a lot of advantages. Very well. Allow me to give you my blessing. I don't know if I'll regret that, honestly. You learn the aura skill, fortify. Now rise, Sal. May our newfound strength guide you in your journey. Okay, fortify doesn't sound like healing. That sounds like a defense buff. Hmm. Alright. Oop, alright. Here I am. Hello. Mm hmm. Hmm. Who do we have here? Mm. Severe injuries, but alive nonetheless. Perhaps this potion can help. Severe injuries. Like, so, yeah, they're... Considering we're meant to be students, I mean, they're pushing yeah, yeah, the boundaries. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you look pitiful. Are you alright? I am now. My ribs hurt. Ah. Good. I'm actually surprised you managed to survive that fall. Yeah. Considering mm. it was inflicted by another student, I mean... Yeah. Ah, uh, but it doesn't really matter now. We're stuck in this damn forest. We will either die of starvation or get killed by monsters. Wait, why are we stuck? Where are we? We are deep inside Fairy Forest. I don't know where exactly we are, though. I came here with a fairy guy, but she left me. Disappointing, isn't it? Next thing I know, I'm running away from hostile fairies. That's how I ended up here. Ah. Oh, but enough with the bad news. Based on your attire, you look like a law mage candidate. May you help me? Who are you? Oh. You can call me Uni. Uni? You can call me Uni. I am on a mission to find a crystal here in Fairy Forest. As you can see, it didn't turn out so well. Do you want to give me a hand? Maybe we can find a way out as we go along. I'll help you. Sure, why not? <laughs> Great, you know, law majors don't usually bother helping with missions that aren't theirs. It's practical that way. Missions are dangerous after all. So I appreciate your decision to help me with this. Well, I thought we were more talking about going, getting out of here, but either way. Anyway, let me fill you on the details of the mission. I was informed that something strange is happening here in Fairy Forest. You see, fairies are friendly and gentle creatures. However, my client was attacked by a group of fairies here. Apparently these attacks have been happening for a while now, but people assumed that the fairies were just defending their territory. Yada. Something doesn't fit with this explanation though. Fairies are known to enchant forests with magic to conceal their territory. They would never attack people unless their lives were threatened. Hence, I suspect that there is something here in Fairy Forest that is affecting the fairies. My mission is to find whatever is affecting the fairy population in Fairy Forest and deal with it. You probably have a lot of questions right now, but we can talk along the way. <laughs> well then, shall we get going? Uni, join the party. Uni, Uni. Wait, is she actually- oh! Oh, she's actually- oh, grade 25, interesting. Oh, alright. Awesome. Okay. Or is she, she going to be an actual party member? Like, what's what's the deal with this? Like, she's actually showing up here, so... That's interesting. But also, big question, how far did we go exactly? <laughs> like, I mean... Seriously, how, how far did we travel that we're, like, in an, this whole other area? Like, I assume our solution would be, okay, we need to get back to our friends, let's find a way back up. Like, how far did we go exactly? And yes, the fact that they seem to be willing to, like, I mean, they weren't necessarily trying to kill me, but it didn't exactly seem like they were against that happening, which seems very extreme, like, so yeah, there's, I don't know if that's, like, just them and they think they can get away with whatever, or if this school is a bit more dodgy in certain regards, you know? Hmm. I guess we'll have to see. I don't know who she is, like, is she involved with the school, or? Hard to say. What are you, purple? No, nothing? Alright. Something? No? Oh, hello, fairy. There you are. I finally found you, trespasser. Outsiders are not allowed here. 
I guess it can't be helped. So I'll try to know how to defend yourself. Okay, so is this going to be like super easy because she's high level or maybe somewhere in the middle? Uh, Alright, so far not a big deal. Okay. Got some silk, very nice. This is bad. We should hurry and find that crystal before these fairies swarm us. That's probably a good idea. Alright. Let's go see what's going on. Shouldn't we want to get out of here, find our friends? Uh, are these just random ones, or...? Outsiders do nothing but destroy and defile nature. We want- we don't want you here. Okay. Oh shit, there's a hole. Alright. Uh, deals holy damage to all enemies. Ooh, nice. Okay. Got some AoE spells going on. Awesome. Oh wow, holy shit. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Wow, alright. Kind of OP. I'll take it. Uh, what do we got there? Oop. Mushrooms? Two glow shrooms, alright. Let's, uh, let's over this way. Anything else this way, or is that just... Alright. Do we want to be fighting all of them, maybe? It does give us a bit extra XP. We regret stepping foot in our territory outside us. I don't know, maybe we want to fight less of them, since we don't actually want to be fighting them. I don't know. What is the XP, though? Hmm. Tough one. Although, oof. They can do a fair bit of damage to us, eh? Uh, that's fine. Maybe I should do something stronger from her. Although, that'll be enough for this one. Yeah. That, when, when that green goes down, it's like... That's serious damage. I guess the fire helps. That knocks down. Oof. We're... Yeah. Alright, we definitely have to heal, though. That enough? Very good. 100. Yeah, Alright. Nice. Nice. Yeah, it's definitely, uh, definitely good XP. Uh, whoop. And heal, please. Thank you. And do do do. Very good. Uh, was that actually? Was that an area? Something? No? Okay. All good. Moving on in this rather creepy forest. I don't really think fairies. It's not a. You know. Not very bright or friendly looking. Uh, okay. Got some wood. How you doing? Are you an enemy or... Wait a minute, I don't want to fight you. Good, I don't, I don't want to fight either. My sisters are angry about outsiders being here. They weren't like this before though. Everything changed when that crystal started to glow. Hmm. Anyway, you look worn out. Let me heal you up. Don't tell me I want to heal you, okay? Wait. Is there anything else I can help you with? Uh, save? Sure. Why not? Is that a one-off heal? Because... If it's not, we could just like... Infinitely grind here. That would be kind of OP. Follow the path worth and you'll arrive at Fairy Village entrance. You have to find the hidden path though. Okay, so it was only a one-off heal. Fair enough, fair enough. Uh, do we want to fight? Yeah, we probably do. I feel like I'm, I'm getting lazy about it, but it's uh, it is good XP. Uh, damn, it's too bad actually. Should have uh, would have been good to save that because she goes through a fair bit of MP if we use these. Although, yeah, relative to how many fights we'll be doing, it's probably still fine, isn't it? All right, very good. Some loot, and oh, this uh, is this something? Yes, very good. I'll take a chest. Yes, I will. Silk, delicious. And one more quick fight. You're in fairy terror. You are not welcome here, outsiders. Yes, I've gotten that impression. Oh damn! What the hell? <laughs> okay. Got blasted away somehow. Yeah. How was that like? That was crazy. That worked very well. Yeah, okay, so her slap attack works. That works, yeah. I'll take it. How much gold are we up to? Alright, we're up to 1800 again, so that's not bad. I assume we're gonna have to... Are we gonna have to, like, fight a crystal? Because that, that's that's kind of strange. I'm not sure. Or are we just trying to get to the village? Oh, lovely. Awesome. It's actually a little village. That's really cool. Oop, loot. Berry clip. I'll take it. Oh, I really like this. It's cool. Yeah, they look great. I really like them. Uh, locked? Okay. Can't steal from every house. Maybe this one? What do we got? Something good? No? Nothing? Wait, are you a chest? Yes, you are. Mossy wood? I'll take it. 
And what's going on up this way? Uh, oh, finally, I've waited so long for somebody, anybody to arrive. Hello? Possibly friendly person? <laughs> Judgment arrives. Mm. Oh. Hmm? Were you in need of assistance, sir? I am a law mage from... You sound like one of Osborne's puppets. Tell me, are you a member of that organization called the Vanguard? Yare, yare. Perhaps it would be best if you introduce yourself first, otherwise I fear for your safety. Oh. Go uni. My safety? You think you can imitate a judge with your hollow threats? So ah. A judge, you say? What nonsense. The judge circle has long been abolished. Yet here I am, fully capable, a fully capable judge standing before you. Sal, if this man truly is what he claims to be, then I need you to go on and finish the mission. We must save the fairies. Whatever is causing them to act aggressively must be dealt with by the vanguard. Uh, I mean, in this case, I feel like it's probably best to listen to her. Uh, I mean, I'm in training. She's, she's, I don't know. I, I mean, I don't know. I really think it's best to listen to her in this oh. case. Thank you, Sal. Don't worry about me. I can handle this. I hope you can. You look promising, kid. Maybe you want to consider joining the judges' circle instead. Ignore him, Sal. These judges are nothing but corrupt law majors with only one end goal. To kill. On my signal, I want you to run as fast as you can and never look back. Find our objective, but do not touch anything. You must wait until I arrive. Understood? You better listen to what she's saying, kid. This can turn ugly. What is your name, judge? Ah, of course. The four malleys of a jewel must be observed. I am Judge Lothbrock of the Judge's Circle. And you are? Law Mage Junior of the Vanguard. Okay. <laughs> ah, aha. This is a special day indeed. Oh, how I've wished to spill a Vanguard's blood all these years. You're in for a lot of disappointment then. Now go, Sile. Send Lux. Okay, I will leave them to battle. Ugh, my eyes. Ah, I wasn't expecting a cheap blinding spell from someone like you. This will be an interesting duel. Uni has left the party. Alright, well. Okay, you're not moving. Does that mean you're friendly? Hello? Please don't hurt me, human. I don't want to fight. I'm hiding from all the quarreling and fighting. You can hide here too if you want. <laughs> Alright. Guess we'll continue on. I guess this is the crystal. This looks like a saving crystal, though. Sile, I sense tremendous power coming from this crystal. You. Have you come to set me free? I don't know. They've imprisoned me in this crystal. I do not want to be here. My presence alone angers the fairies. I never wanted to bother anybody. I only wanted to help. The experiment hurt me so much. But I will go with you. Anywhere is better than here. I beg of you. Sile, I recognize that voice. Her name is Fajora. If you help her, I'm sure you will gain a powerful ally. Uh... Okay... How do you know her? Who is she? Who is Fajora? And what do you mean I'll gain an ally? The sudden release of an immense aura might permanently affect the fairies. However, it is still worth considering to take her with us. Okay... I mean... You suddenly remember Uni's instructions. Find our objective, but do not touch anything. You must wait until I arrive, understood? The choice is yours, Sile. Well, I, I don't know. Like, I, I feel inclined to break it, both, well, mainly because it's more interesting. But, like, I mean, can I trust past? Like, I, I don't really understand. Like, past is basically encouraging it. I just don't know if I should be listening to that or not. Um... I mean, you, like, I feel like past is telling me to, but it sounds like there could be a negative impact. Ah, uh, for better or worse, I'm going to break it. I'll say my hand flip. Should be fine. That's realistic, right? You acquired Fajora. Thank you for liberating me from my prison. From this day onward, I promise to be obedient and aid you in the best of my abilities. To show my sincerity, allow me to unseal that cave for you. Know that I am your faithful servant from now on. Okay. Perhaps you can equip this crystal to help Law Mage Junior. Uh, can I? What? What is... Is that what I received? Where... 
Is it in here somewhere? No? Quit? Uh, oh, crystal. Oh, and heals a crystal. That wasn't a... I thought that must... Okay. Allows the user to cast and heal. Oh. Plus four mage weak to pierce. Wait, so... Oh, so this crystal, if I didn't choose and heal, this crystal would have given me that ability? It is and heal that I have, yeah, of course it is, right. So I guess that's, like, if you, if I, okay, well that's kind of interesting then. So if I chose, like, the flame one, I would have actually been able to get in heal via this crystal. And it does give you plus four magic as well, but then you also become weak to pierce. Interesting. Uh, yeah, what's Fajora though? Like, is that meant to be a person? Like, what, what, I don't understand what that is. I said it allows the carry to cast Fajora, and it also gives five magic, two to resistance, two to agi, agility. That's pretty good. <laughs> All right. Uh, is also any of this worth anything better? I think we're all good there. All right. Well, I've equipped it. Should I go help her, or do I go to the cave? Oh, okay. Thesis on organs. Okay. Not really sure what to make of that. Um, also, I didn't actually check what this was, did I? Oh, heals all allies and increased defense for three turns. Ooh, that's pretty nice, actually. That's not, that's, yeah, that's not bad. I'll take that, for sure. What have you done? You broke the crystal, didn't you? I, I feel better? <laughs> oh, not better. Did I do something bad? Maybe. Okay, maybe that was a bad idea. Maybe I can hopefully at least help Unia. Maybe. Oh, that doesn't look good. What a shame. Apparently a vanguard is only as good as a lowly mage. Yeah. Ah, your companion has returned. After I kill you, I'll cast the same pill on the kid as I did on you. I'll make sure you two suffer the same amount of pain. It's a very specific thing to say. Your aura is as corrupt as your deej, bastard judge. Heh. <laughs> it appears I won't be disappointed today. Hmm? Oop. Not, a, not so fast, scum. Oh, I win! I found Zelka! I found Zelka Sensei. One remove and I'll end your life. I'm no stranger to dealing with scum like you. Oh, she's just coming in to fuck shit up. <laughs> if it isn't the bane of judges herself, the one-eyed maiden, Law Mage Zelka. Go Zelka Sensei. It appears my luck today is as rotten as your prospects for marriage. Pity. <laughs> Slam. You wretched mage. Trenzio. Involt. Careful there, you're gonna burn Unia. <laughs> that bastard mage. What a mess. Help me tidy things up, will you, sir? Uh, sure. Do you have a revival flask to spare, Sol? Union needs one right now. I'm sure she'll appreciate it. Yeah. Sure do. Wait, does that mean she was dead? <laughs> ah, that feels great. Like a warm bath on a cold night. What took you so long? I sent a stress signal minutes, 10 minutes mm. ago. Sigh. Oh well, I should have known. You have, a, you have a reputation for being late after all. <laughs> I didn't expect you to go down so quickly against the judge. You disappoint me. Touché. Clap back. Yunya, I am sending you back to headquarters. I will take Saar with me to Zoklat Hills and rendezvous with the rest of the class. Fair enough. Thanks, Selka. Not even a thanks for me? I mean, actually, I didn't listen to what she said, so... Well. But what about the crystal? Like, it, that, that actually ended sort of weird. I mean, shouldn't Yunya have said something about the crystal or... Mentioned, like, that, yeah, that, that, that was strange, actually. Headbo Headmaster Osborne. Yes, I'm with the Candace now. I sent Lorma Junior ahead due to her injuries. Oh. So that's what happened, huh? Good thing Lorma Zelka found you on time. Mm. After hearing what happened, I'm just glad you're still alive, Sire. Listen up, noobs. I know you're all enjoying yourselves with our little game of hide and seek, but due to immediate security concerns, we have to cut this trip short. Moreover, even though I voluntarily showed myself to you, I will consider this a pass for our class on aura breaks. You'll clear the aura breaks class. Very good. Very good. What matters is that you have learned how to exploit enemy weaknesses and take advantage of an aura break. 
Now, in order to give you sufficient experience for further training, I will refer you to your mentors. Oh? What? As you know, Law Mage Academy has four houses. Each house is supervised by a mentor who is in charge of student affairs in that house. Disciplinary rules, events, organization, and the safety of students in their house. All of these are part of the mentor's jobs. More importantly, they are in charge of assigning missions to students. You can find your mentor office inside your houses. Make sure to properly introduce yourselves. Clear? Okay. Law Mage Zelka, mentor's office. Law Mage Zelka has instructed us to meet our house mentor. I can find the mentor's house inside my house. Wait. Oh, yeah, like, okay. I can't wait to meet my mentor. Okay, so is that, like, a new room and I've just somehow missed it? Or is that, like... I... Okay, I don't know where that would be exactly. Alright, good stuff. I'll leave you all with that. Make sure you talk to your mentor as soon as you can. Class dismissed. Uh, yeah, it was sort of weird how the crystal just got ignored at the end there. Like, like nothing was done with that or talked to us about it or anything. Like, that was... That, that didn't seem quite right. Like, that didn't finish properly or something. Uh, yeah. A little bit strange, that. It looks like we are wrapping up for a normal night here. Uh, I would say so. Of which, um... I don't know, what, do we want to do a job? I feel like we got plenty of money. It's probably worth just having it. Well... Um, we have two espressos. Yeah, so I think we can do, re do that. Oh shit, I almost... Did I miss that this morning? Did I miss the cup of coffee this morning? I can't believe I missed that. Alright. Uh, oh, wait. There's no job? I didn't have a job option. Talk. So you don't want to sleep yet, huh? That's fine. You can take a job if you want. I'll pay for your trouble. Well, actually, no. It seems like you don't have a job for me. Oh, wait. Just, oh, what the fuck? Okay, don't mind me, I don't know, I, oh my god, my brain, apparently. I was just completely ignoring job there, like, like the bottom option is usually exit or something, I, I don't know, my, yeah, my brain, it is what it is. Alright, I'm glad you're here to help me keep things tidy. I mean, hey, we may as well grab 180, it's, it's not overly worth it. I feel like it's very mixed, but, yeah, I don't know, it risks being tired, but we have enough espresso, so, yeah. I feel like it's not actually worth being tired, but at the same time, it's like, you know. Oh, oh, actually, that was probably... We could have read, couldn't we? Because we did get, um... Yeah, we got this thesis on organs, which I don't know what exactly that is, but I, it could... Uh, that could have been worth reading. Oh, that's right. Oof, alright. Well, I think that is going to do it for this one. Uh, my recording says an hour and forty, so... This is probably at least an hour and a half, which sort of threw away what I said at the end of the last one about being shorter, so... It's fine, though. This ended up double the last one. That's totally fine. Uh, anyway, as I said, just, uh, I think that's gonna do it for this one. It has been good. I've been enjoying it. Um, just, yeah, it's good. I, I didn't pay... Is it the 20th now? I was not paying as much attention as I should have just then. Uh, but I guess we're, yeah, we're, it's about the 20th either way, so we're about halfway through the days. No idea how much longer it's gonna be. But with this episode hitting that, that makes for, what is that, three and a half, forty, like so, like five and a half, a little bit more, a bit more than that, you know, somewhere between five and a half and six hours, I think, uh, unless I just mix that up, no, because, yeah, it was like four, yeah, so, maybe like five hours, forty-five or something so far, so somewhere in that range, anyway, a fair bit, more than you'd expect, um, so it will be definitely interesting to see how much we have left. As for moving forward, I guess we next will be going to check out the other classes. Uh, we'll see if Iron or, or um, Alyssa has any updates. I don't know if like Jin or... I'm forgetting the white hairs girl's name. Uh, I'm bad with names. It takes a few times to click in. But anyway, yeah, I don't know if we're going to be seeing more of them soon or something. Or uh, We also have an announcement here, so I guess that'll be something to check. Uh, I don't know, maybe the shop, see if anything new, see if anything... Because I don't know if we're going to be able to, like, buy armor from that, uh, teacher. Like, if that's just going to update at some point, or... But yeah, that's, uh, if made it this far, thank you very, very much for watching. I hope you're still enjoying this. Uh, let me know if you have any thoughts of any other indie RPGs to check out. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one, hopefully soon. Bye-bye.